on the flight, a, a national paper had a tiny item, 675 farmers committing suicide in August in one district of India alone. One state, one month. Pardon, we sit down on Kaichu. Then we sit. Cortuara, Parma Tridon. Two white children go with them. You know, in the same year, I said, I will, and I know eighty and eighty would have come over. I'm not a bad part of the country. I don't think any more in the Farmer Lee Kwang Hu commits suicide in the middle of a demonstration as a protest against the rich country's agricultural policies. Farmer Lee's suicide shows that the farmer's suicides in India are not an aberration, not an exception. But the EU and the United States are adamant. They want their trade barriers against the poor countries to remain in place, and they want to go on being able to dump surplus agricultural products on the third world. Don't you know that what is good for the United States and the EU is good for the world? WTO is an instrument of corporate unilateralism. The case of GMOs is initiated by Monsanto, not by the citizens of the United States. These are the kind of interests that drafted the trade-related intellectual property rights agreement, the giant pharmaceutical industry, which is the same as the giant uh, biotech industry, which is the same as the giant seed industry, which is the same as the giant agrochemical industry. It's the same industry. WTO is only their instrument, it's a unilateral instrument, it can only be used in unilaterally, that's why it is in need of deep change and deep reform. So, I think we're... They have to come through here. Even I want to go to the loop. where are you all? During the Cancun negotiations, an American organization suddenly starts distributing GM foods to Mexican farmers. Then we got the food that we bought. It's Greenpeace and Abdania watch proceedings, and the world's press covers the meeting. We would like to see the same type of free market, free enterprise capitalism that has made America what it is today, uh, a very rich and prosperous nation, uh, be a model for what can happen here. We have found great response from the residents in this particular community to our message. We have given them uh, groceries as a gesture of friendship. 
and uh, have met with their leaders, and they are very enthusiastic about a long-term partnership with the uh, U.S. free market NGOs. Yes, they are aware that they are receiving regular groceries from a regular store uh, that does contain genetically modified foods. Si no hay fila, no se les da. Si van a estar en fila, va a ser uno por familia, por favor. Hay bastantes familias, hay suficientes despensas. We are here because we think this is a propaganda event from Monsanto. We are sure this Monsanto and the other transgenic corporations are doing, the, are doing this in order to control the, the food of the world. Let them choose. If they can choose for them, fine. If they can, no, you are forfeiting them. This is our people. They are exploiting them. This is the food that comes no. from their own grocery. Why don't you come from India to distribute this food every day? Why are you coming today? GM food, GM corn that is produced in Mexico is destroying the Mexican if, corn if, market. If, if, How is that supposed to be a solution? If they are destroying, the if, How is that supposed to be a solution? If they are destroying the Mexican corn market, then these people would be the first one to oppose and reject it. Who? These people here. These, these people, people, let these people decide whether they want the Monsanto variety. What choice are you giving them? They're hungry and you're giving them GM food. Virtually 200 million Americans eat this corn for the last 10 years. And if the children or the adults had a problem, they would have had a no. So they didn't have a chance to decide. They, 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 they are we are watching what is going to happen to the American children. When? We are not. 10 years is not when? a long time. Oh, when is not a long time. The children have the longest time in the world. These people should have the ultimate freedom to decide whether they want the Monsanto or whether they want somebody else. GM food has failed in India. It has you know, I'll give an example. committing suicide because of the failure of I'll GM. Give an example. These farmers are not interested whether it is GM or whether it's organic or whether it's anything chemical. Farmers are interested primarily in something that gives them some de degree of uh, income. And spurious is an indication, the tremendous demand that they have for anything that would give them a hope to improve their livelihood, improve the condition of their family. I think they should be the ones who should decide, not, not us and him and anybody else. They should be the ones to decide. The negotiations in Cancun have reached a deadlock. As usual, the USA and the EU are confident the outcome will be to their advantage. But the developing countries march out of the meeting. The third world has had enough. The USA and the EU cannot go on dictating agreements. <laughs> and there is no agreement in Cancun. Happy, happy. Now the WTO is delegitimated, it's discredited, and we can go on to further global, global talks in the United Nations, maybe. Arrogant representatives of powerful governments, Europeans, Americans, or corporations, come around in arrogance thinking bullying the third world is their right. When Vandana returns to Dehradun, her brother Kuldip is there to meet her. Today, I am free. I'm not already committed. I'll be with you. She's got so many things to attend to. 
it's, uh, it gets exhausting. It tells upon you uh, physically and in many other ways. My other sister Mira is also quite concerned. She also says that Vandana is following too hectic a pace. But then she gets so involved and she meets people around who, um, I think, motivate her and encourage her and she gets going on that fuel. No, no, I take Kuldeep's care very seriously. And before that, before while he was in service, my, my dad used to be here. I mean, in my life, it's just, it's been my dad, Kuldeep, Mira, are the three people who ever, who ever say, you don't have to do more. So in a way, you know, they are the balance in my life. The kind of upbringing we had, we, we weren't allowed to think that money, property is important, relationships are important. But we live here as we did as children. Our home was always available to movements. It's been possible for me to build movements because I never had to wait for money. Everything happened from this little place. And my old dad would drive down in his old Fiat, which still, Kuldeep still drives it. I like done that because, you know, in my childhood, this old man was the most inspiring feature in my life. <laughs> Einstein. This is my uh, writing. This is your this is your secret. This is this is my corner. Well, you disappear from the world. Right? Absolutely. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. And, and this is this is where we have the cows. You know, no, no other house do you have an entry at the level of the ground. It's at the same level because the cows had to walk in. They couldn't climb steps. So, you know, this was for, for the cows, this place. Was, so I say, I got my parents' spirit and the spirit of all the cows blessing our work. <laughs> Oh, we should be moving. Yeah, I got late. Just... are adapted to the region. Oh, oh, oh. Because we had been trying hard for yeah. the seed, but the yeah. feedback coming from the grassroots level, they said that this said some soil testing and or weather condition has to be seen. So yeah. that prolonged our yeah. like... No, but the ones that are available yeah, in right. that area are yeah. adapted. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. When we do in future the intensive workshop yes. in Dehradun, yes. I'll tell friends anywhere in the world that at this time we will be working yes. with the Tibetan community and we would like them to give some time. Right, right. So we get not just the top experts in India yes. to support this shift to organic, yes. Yes. we get the top experts of the world right. to work together yes. to help us. We have decided to strengthen the agriculture system, to revitalize the soil, discarding the uh, uh, chemical things and make it completely organic and then they should grow the uh, crops which they are using. No, they made a decision. It's a policy decision. It's a cabinet decision. Yeah. That all Tibetan settlements will change. Will change. Will stop the chemical. 
I don't care whether I'm moving ahead or moving back. I have to stop. 